<laughs> Hello guys, good morning guys, it's T here, uh, Thai Nomad. Uh, the air is packing up right now, it's such a good morning, so we are getting ready to head back to Chum Pon. But before we head back to Chum Pon, we have a few places to stop. Um, so I hope it's going to be a good day. It's getting a little bit cloudy today, so uh, it's been night for two days. So it's getting a little bit cloudy today, so I hope it doesn't rain. Anyway, I hope you guys um, come with us on today's video, a third day of our trip. Okay guys, so um, we are getting ready and before we leave, I would like to show you guys uh, a little bit more about this resort. Um, it's pretty nice. We actually paid 2,000 baht for uh, the, the dorm uh, room. So you have uh, cottages, well there are two types, you know, cottages and the dorm. The dorm is more expensive. Uh, I believe the cottages cost about 1500 or 1800 I'm not sure but um, but the, the dorm costs more uh, because we have a jacuzzi in front but uh, the cottages they don't so um, so yeah man such a nice day we had a good stay last night we slept like a baby um, actually it's the best resort that we have stayed at in the Hausa Tamarat province. So uh, they had they have pretty good food too. This morning we had um, fried rice and hot dogs and fried eggs, coffee, uh, toast, some toast. So it's pretty good. A little bit above average. <laughs> so yeah. So here is another section of uh, the resort, so cottages. I believe they have uh, about three or four dorm rooms, you know, like, like the dorms, like ours. So um, other than that, they have cottages. So um, this place is called uh, Chanya, Chanya Resort, right? So, uh, so they have uh, this is the name, where they have uh, the rooms, all types of rooms, the viewpoint, so the viewpoint is over there, the star, do you see the star? So, um, so yeah, so each part has access to the river, the lake, the, the stream, so um, yeah, it's a pretty good deal. I, I kind of wish we we could have taken uh, the money, the money that we spent at the uh, the restaurant on our first day, and pay here, <laughs> and then pay here and stay an extra night, so two nights. So such a good vibe, you know, like uh, off the grid. You know, you have time for yourself, and you can you know do whatever you want. So it's pretty good. Okay, so I'm gonna go check out on deer. Gonna check on there and we're gonna start heading hitting the road. Wow, such a unique cafe. This cafe is a minimal style cafe. It's called Bus Cafe. Cafe, right guys very unique because they have turned uh, an antique Japanese made bus into a cafe very very unique I really like it 
very creative. This cafe is surrounded by mountain ranges and rivers. This bus actually has been imported from Japan and been passed from generation to generation. Okay guys, so we are here at Wat Thad Noi, it's the Thad Noi Temple, uh, still in Nakhon Sri Thamrat province. Um, I'm actually at the, um, the platform, the train platform. I must say this is the nicest platform I've ever seen in Thailand. So they have um, a Buddhism, a Buddhist style um, waiting area, the platform. So you can take the train and get off here and you can visit uh, one of Nakhon Sri Thamrat's popular temples. Did you get us the uh, the flowers and the candles? Okay, we have the flowers and uh, the candles. Okay, good. So, um, guys, do you know what these Buddhas are for? Do you know what these Buddhas are for? Do you know? Um, actually, they are the Buddha of your birth date. Uh, so, for example, this one is for Sunday. This one is Monday. This one is Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. And uh, I'm not sure about this one. So basically by lighting uh, the candles, it's just to give the light to your life, you know, belief. Okay guys, so um, we gonna go up there to see uh, the most respected abbot of this this area or in Nakhon Sri Thamrat province. He is the most respected abbot and he, when he passed away, his body uh, did not decompose. So they, 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 they keep his body in the coffin, the glass coffin. So, so we're gonna go see his body up there and pay respect. Okay guys, so we're gonna go under his coffin. So this is his coffin, uh, the respected abbot. So uh, we're gonna go under here. It's believed to, um, it's believed to have a uh, good impact on your life. So uh, if you go under here, it means you're gonna have good luck. Okay. So we have to go under here three times. <laughs> Two. And the last one, three. <laughs> so guys. So up here is his body. So um, his body did not decompose. So it is kept here for people to pay respect. So and that's his actual body. So um, guys, the story behind um, the body of his. Is that um, the fact that uh, his body did not decompose because uh, well I asked you that um, it means that the monk did the right thing or 
the monk has become enlightened and followed, strictly followed, um, the rule of Buddhism. I think it's making sound. It's starting to make sound. So in Buddhism ideology, so if a person who has good fortune rub the gong and if the gong makes the sound, make the noise, the sound, it means that that person has good fortune. So uh, in scientific method or idea, it can be proved differently. But in Buddhism, like I said, if the gong make the sound like that, it means the person has good fortune. Mm, it's making sound. Mm. He has good fortune or not. <laughs> Two thousand years later. <laughs> I don't think I have good fortune. It's not working, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Today's video is going to be a short one because uh, we only have uh, only two or three places left. So, so after the temple, after here, we're going to go have some lunch at the local restaurant. It's a Chinese Thai restaurant, very popular, very well known in southern Thailand. So. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna go have some lunch and then we're gonna start heading to Chumpan, heading back to Chumpan. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay guys, um, plans change a little bit because we went to the Chinese uh, Thai restaurant that I promised that I was gonna show you guys. Uh, <laughs> it actually closed today, so um, we had to stop at uh, the food restaurant uh, on the side of the road for a quick bite. So, like I said, today's video is going to be a little bit short because we're going to start heading back to Chumpon because tomorrow we're going to have to uh, go to Wohin go to Wohin and Pachaburi uh, because one of their cousins, one of their relatives just passed away so we're going to go to her funeral in Pachaburi so, uh, so yeah, it's going to be a short one so, but uh, I hope you guys still had fun but anyway uh, Let's head back to Shimpon. Okay guys, we are finally home. It's been a long day driving and trying to get to places. But um, one of the places we, we missed was the, uh, the Chinese and Thai restaurant, a, a well-known Chinese and Thai restaurant in Nakhon Si Tamarat province. Uh, it closed today, so we have to change the plan, like I said. Um, but anyway... If you love our video, please support us by subscribing, liking, and sharing our channel. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I know it's a short one, but at least I hope you guys enjoyed a little bit. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you. Bye! Bye.